FC Edmonton wrapped up their first season in the North American Soccer League on October 1st, but that's not where the work stopped for this upcoming one. The team took a month off, then headed inside to begin their second season of daily practice sessions. We're here to uh, just obviously keep keep in shape as well. I mean, uh, you don't want to have too too much of a layover, otherwise things uh, start going wrong. And if you keep on a tick like this, it's it's good to, uh, like I said, just keep the fitness levels up and, like you said, just get, get touches on the ball. Technical skills, but also technical skills. But, but, but what we try to do is because in this facility we can't play eight against eight, nine against nine because it's too small. So we try to break the... the, the the game in small pieces and we say okay we work now together with the wingers or with midfielders through the through the center of the field so we try to break the game in, in small pieces and, and and then we can also train very specific with the guys i think a big problem going into the preseason is a lot of guys get two three months off and they're really they do their workout but they don't do it at, at intensity that we're doing right now so it'll help us tremendously the team finished 5th in league standings with 10 wins, 12 losses and 6 ties before losing in the first round of the playoffs. There are a lot of positives though to take from last season that have them hungry for this one to begin. Uh, a lot of positive things. Um, you can see that the players, they, they, they became better. Uh, you can see it uh, also in the training sessions now. To, uh, it, you see the level is, is higher, so everything goes quicker. Um, play the ball harder. and. Um, so, so and technical skills are better. It's a little tough training for so long and not being able to play a 90-minute game, but uh, we're hungry. We know after the first season we had, we know that we're capable of winning, winning the league, so we're looking forward to that this season. Aside from getting better through these training sessions, the team has also made plenty of lineup changes already this offseason. We're always looking to make our squad better, right? So uh, if we want to get to that next level, we got to bring in players that can, that can come in and do a good job. And, and so far, we've, we've got a few guys that came in and, and they've done well. FC Edmonton will begin training camp in two months. And for more information on the team, visit fcedmonton.com. Jordan Greenlee, Shaw TV, Capital Region.